Hi, I'm Michelle Albert reporting for Bass City Beat. I'm here at the Macomb County Sheriff Marine Division, where we're witnessing some fire training exercises on Lake St. Clair. What's going on here today? Uh, we're doing some fire training. Uh, we do it approximately once a year. We'd like to do it more, but time and uh, lack of uh, boats enable us to do it. But we're doing, uh, taking some of our reserves out and showing them how to fire up the fire pumps and uh, extinguish boat fires that happen out in the lake. Because to my knowledge that uh, there's no fire department in Macomb County that has any firefighting equipment for boats. Yeah, it's a great training, okay? There's nothing like hands-on training. Uh, we can talk about it in the classroom to a blue in the face, but when you go actually go out there and actually hold the hose and throw it on that fire, uh, it's great training. That being said, Darren and I suited up in our life jackets and headed on to the speedboat, which would take us right into the middle of the action. training benefit the Marine Division? Well, it, it makes us better. I mean, training always uh, helps everybody. Uh, you know, experience, you, you can learn stuff in a classroom, but doing actual hands-on training is the best way to you know how to teach our guys what, what to do. While we watched the fire training exercise, Lieutenant Barlock was standing by to answer any questions we had about what exactly was going on. How many fires do you guys take in? Like, uh, normally it's about, I don't know, Five, but uh, we like to keep down as much as we can. Yeah. Right. <laughs> Your main concern is, you know, it's not the outside of the boat that's burning, so you want to try and throw water into the deep belt where the actual source of the fire is. How did you have to notify other uh, boaters in the area that you're going to be doing this exercise? Yeah, today? we did a special uh, marine broadcast. We notified the uh, local area fire departments and especially our dispatch because I'm sure they're going to probably get some calls about a boat fire. So. How does this benefit the public? Well, I mean, if we're able to use our equipment properly, we can hopefully save property and or lives. Uh, last year was an instance, uh, Harbor Club South Apartments on Jefferson was uh, on fire, a whole section, and uh, we used a couple of our uh, fire pumps to do the back of the building because the uh, fire department didn't have any fire hydrants back there and they had no way of uh, putting water on the back of the apartment, so we assisted in helping them with that. What other tasks does the Marine Division do? Well, we, uh, we patrol the lakes in uh, Macomb County, we enforce uh, all the uh, marine laws. Uh, we assist boaters who are in distress or need help. We teach boater safety classes to 7th uh, and 8th graders, and hopefully uh, we teach them things that someday down the line may save their lives or somebody else. Uh, during the winter time, uh, we do ice rescue training, and we also do ice rescue. That uh, fishermen, you know, they get stuck out on the ice, we have to go out there and uh, hopefully bring it back safe. We'd like to thank Lieutenant Barlog for taking us out today to witness this training exercise. This hands-on training helps the Marine Division work more effectively and ensures your safety on the water. For Bass City Beat, I'm Michelle Alward.